find us again on all four Mississippi Thunder. And we're going to have a video coming up on Red Dot, so y'all stay tuned. for Mississippi Thunder. Thank you to all the previous viewers and subscribers for coming back. And any new viewers, y'all make sure that you hit that subscribe button. All of y'all hit that thumbs up. Give us a thumbs up on the video for a like it. We appreciate that. Hit that bell for notification because you don't want to miss anything that happens over here at All for Mississippi Thunder. We do have some new exciting content coming up next week that we closed the deal on yesterday. So y'all better watch out for that. And make sure you're staying tuned. Anyway, today we're talking about a red dot. And yes, it is one of the little budget red dots. This is the Fiat V30. Um, standard aluminum housing. It has uh, the front multi-coated reticle, scratch resistant. It comes with, well, first of all, let me show you this little comes with this little nice box which that's kind of cool but I don't know I mean once you put it on your firearm you're not gonna need the box again it comes with a anti-glare that screws on the front of it, which is a neat little touch it also comes with little caps to cover it up or to cover the uh, front and back it has two of those stick on there um, it takes the standard uh, 2032 battery, little screw off housing there. Something that is neat that they've started doing, I noticed they did on a, a few of them, is the turrets, or not the turrets, but the uh, adjustments. Screw this off. There. The turret, or these adjustment caps have a little part of a flathead on it. So if you make adjustments, you just take that, flip it over, line it up and make your click see the way you prefer it has it's a 20 millimeter uh, eyepiece unlimited eye relief it has on the side it has a power button so it's a, like electronic it doesn't have like an analog dial it has the actual buttons here and it has a up for the power and then a down on the power it has 10 brightness settings, um, and it looks pretty good. I'll see if I can get you a picture of the reticle itself. It comes with the attached bracket for like an absolute co-witness, but it has a bracket for lower one-third co-witness. You just take those four little screws out and put them in there. It has your little, it comes with the tools, a few more screws, and an extra 2032 battery. Oh, and not forget the cleaning cloth. Um, it seems pretty nice. It's one reason I picked this particular optic when the Fiat rep contacted me. By the way, this was sent to me by Fiat rep, free to me to review. But as you know, on all four Mississippi Thunder, I will give you a fair and honest review, no matter if it's sent to me or not. Uh, it has the motion activated illumination. So supposedly, when you you know move it. If it's off, it'll come on. Uh, something I have noticed, okay, it does stay on for two hours, but something I have noticed that is you have to, like if it's off and you hadn't cut it on for a while, you have to cut it on. It'll go off in two hours, and then once you shake it awake, it'll come back on. So I guess if you were having it on like a self-defense type firearm, you would want to make sure that you cut it on pretty regular and let it do its little thing and cut back off because I hadn't been able to get it to shake awake just from being off for you know a couple days or anything it has to be turned on let it it runs out in two hours I don't know why it takes two hours to cut off that seems like a 
odd amount of time for it to not sense any motion and cut off. But it cuts off after two hours, and then you can shake it awake and it'll work. I haven't tried it, you know, leaving it setting for 10 hours. I've tried it, you know, setting for a day and then trying to pick it up and it won't come on. But right now it's on. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. See if we can get you a view of the red dot down in there. Okay. It's pretty clear. It has a little starburst around it. Uh, they call it a 2MOA dot. I'd probably say, you know, the center is, but it starbursts out to about four, you know, yeah. I would say just by looking in there. It did mention, or in the brochure, that it's certified up to 800 Gs of recoil. So I'm not exactly sure what that entails or what produces that type of Gs of recoil. Um, they they wanted the video out prior to Prime Days because Fiat is having a sale, and I'll show you the flyer they're sending me right here. Okay. Um, I didn't see any optics on that list, but you can look at that and maybe you see something you want that's up to 35% off. Um, I think that's about it on this. I don't believe there's much else to cover. We will get it mounted up in the next couple weeks. Like I said, I have some big stuff coming up next week. Let's go ahead and roll in a word from our sponsors because... Let's have a word from our sponsors. We appreciate each and every one of them. Franklin Armory, Bear Creek Arsenal, Pro 2A Tactical. If you go and purchase anything from Pro 2A Tactical, make sure in the comment section at checkout that you put capital R, the number 4, capital M, capital T, and that's our referral code to let them know that we are sending our viewers over there to buy something from them. And if you're local to the Meridian, Mississippi area, check out our friends over at Rock House Gun and Pawn. They have a nice variety of firearms and ammunitions and a lot of other stuff that you would find at a pawn shop. Also check out Lucky Day Pawn in Philadelphia, Mississippi. Also take them to the back porch. At the back porch you can find a nice variety of outdoor and unique items. So y'all check that out. Thank you for coming back to see us on Awful Mississippi Thunder. Hope you enjoyed this little video. Uh, remember for I have learned to be content in every situation. That comes from Philippians 4.11. God bless you and God bless America.